Just one and we'll see you and welcome to an episode of Pizza Theater. On this episode of Pizza Theater, we are going to learn how to do a double cross over the shoulder. On a few episodes back of Pizza Theater, we learned how to do a single cross over the shoulder. Let me show you how a single cross over the shoulder looks like. That's how a single cross over the shoulder looks like, okay? And before you start doing the double cross over the shoulder, you need to master both hands, okay? You need to master how to do a single cross over the shoulder with both hands. Left and right, okay? It's very important for you guys to learn it with both hands to do double cross over the shoulder, okay? Um, this is just a very simple move, okay? The trick to it, it's the way we position our hands, okay? Our thumbs are a guide. They should always be pointing to the sides, okay? If they point a little bit back, okay, then the dough is going to come from the back to the front and when they get into the middle of our back, they're going to crash, okay? That's what they're going to do. They're going to crash in the middle. But if our both thumbs are pointing to the side, okay, then the dough should come across over your back with no problem like that. And make sure that you guys give about a foot of space when you do the move, okay? Like that. So it's very important, the thumbs, okay? Pointing to the sides while we throw. You should feel your fingernail from your thumb uh, hitting yourself, okay? If it's pointing back, okay, then you're gonna have, then you're gonna fail uh, doing the double cross over the shoulder, okay? So that's very important. Okay, how you position your hands, and that's how we position. Both thumbs to the side, okay, we put about a foot of space, and then we can do our double cross over the shoulder, okay. And this one, uh, we do one hand, when we do the cross, one hand goes under our arm, like that, and the other one goes over our neck. We don't do it under the arm. So one hand goes under the arm and the other one goes over the neck, like that, okay? That's how it goes, okay? That's how you do it. You can practice it a few times with your thumbs, okay? Just hit your shoulders or your back and your neck. When you feel ready, you can let go, okay? But you want this movement to always come from a basic, okay? So you can do basics outside, okay? Do a full whip, set them up, set your hands like that, and then get your thumbs ready to do the cross, okay? Make sure they're pointing to the sides and release, okay? And to catch this one, it's very easy. If you do it the right way, then the dose should fall in your hand. What you do is you cross and you open your hands right away and the dose should fall on your hand, okay? So you don't have to reach out for them, okay? Because if you reach out for them, you might poke a hole in your dough, okay? So this one, you wanna do it and just wait for them here, like that. You crossed and you wait for them here. Both of them should land on your hand, okay? So it's a very, uh, easy move, it shouldn't take you that much of problems now that you guys know uh, the shortcuts to do it, okay? But the most important thing is the way you throw it, okay? That you give enough space in between your hands and that your thumbs are always pointing to the side when you throw, okay? Because if they're pointing in a different position, they're gonna, they're gonna go from the back to the front and they're gonna crash on your back, okay? Also, you want to take this position, you want to lean forward a little bit while you do the double cross. Like this, you're going to give them more room on your shoulders to cross. Because if you do it like that, standing up, you're going to have a lot of hard, uh, of hard times doing it, okay? So you want to lean a little bit forward and cross that. See? Also, uh, don't stand up uh, too early. Because if you stand up while they're still crossing, you're going to kill the rotation and you're going to kill the movement, okay? So make sure you stay in position 
can move once you catch the toe. Okay? Don't come up before time because then you're gonna kill the rotation on both of them, of both those, or at least one on your back. Okay? So <clears throat> let's do it one more time. There we go. See? It's a very simple move, a double cross over the shoulder. Okay? So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Pizza Theater. Don't forget to like pmq.com, use pizzasin.com and don't forget to watch Pizza Theater and Pizza TV. See you guys next week on another episode of Pizza Theater.